Breaking news into our studios off the top at five. H.M. King High School in Kingsville is now releasing students classroom by classroom as law enforcement searches the campus for a gun. The Claiborne County Sheriff's Office has also been called in to assist. Now this is a developing situation. We are joined now by Bill Churchwell, who is live for us on scene. So Bill, what can you tell us? Well, I can tell you that there is still an active police presence as we speak. Take a look right over here. You can see this street is currently blocked. You have police right there detouring traffic into the shopping area. But now take a look right over here. You can see all of the cop cars lined up in the parking lot of the high school right there. You can see that DPS trooper driving on through and you can see all the buses there. But then you can see all the students that have just been let out. They are being brought here across the street. We were told just minutes ago by a couple of students that they were being searched before being brought outside. We've seen parents parking right over here. If you take a look Look in this area. This is where all of the parents have staged up waiting to pick up their kids. Now we started getting reports late this afternoon about the large police presence at the campus. The Claiborne County Sheriff's Office confirmed to 3 News that law enforcement was here searching for a gun that students were allegedly passing around. That prompted the response from Kingsville PD, the Claiborne County Sheriff's Office, DPS and many more law enforcement agencies. We've seen those agencies here armed and with tactical gear going inside of the school. This also prompted a number of parents out here uh, to flock to the campus to see what was going on. Many of them said that they got text messages from the students uh, talking about a possible gun on campus, the active situation. Now, the school usually lets out right around 4 p.m. And as I said, students ended up being released building by building and escorted here across the street next to uh, this shopping area. What is not known at this point is whether a gun was ever found or if anyone has been questioned or taken into custody. It's still a very active scene out here and we are waiting for law enforcement officials to uh, give us an update on the situation. But for now, reporting live, I'm Bill Churchwell. Now back to you. All right, Bill, thank you so much. So if you have